Smeg. <laughs> Good morning, Bertie. Ow, Smeg. <laughs> Come on, get up, you lazy sod. Fuck you, Smeg. Oh, ho, you've got some good smeg. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, come on, Bertie, get off your side. We got some roads to liberate. What a lovely day today. The sky is nice and- Ah, brilliant day indeed. Brilliant day to flee the roads. I'll cut you out with your free the roads, BS. You can't even free a hen from your luggage compartment. Yeah? Well, you can't even free your wheels from a ditch. Weak. Or well, can you two cut it out already? I can't hear myself think of your chain. You think? More than you do. Oh, damn. Not really good at comebacks, are you, Bulgy? I mean, the last time you tried making a comeback, the passengers got covered in feathers. Oh, double roast. Oh, shot it, you two. Cool. Anyway, I'm going up to shops. You want anything? Oh, I wouldn't mind a Twix. Get me your Snickers. Who's the muppet that dumped these crates? Oi! Get out of my way! Ow! Watch it, you! Oi! Stay out of my way! Look what you made me do! Hey, 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 hey! There's no need to be rude! <clears throat> Very well then. Now who put these crates here? Weren't me. Well then get them out of the way! Alright, no need to- Hey, what are you doing? You can't just dump some crates on the middle of the line. Who cares? It's their problem now. Now shove off! Also. What a lovely day to be doing things the Great West Way. I sure hope nothing bad happens like crates blocking the line. Oi, you Great Western brat, watch where you... Oh. <coughs> You prick! Wait, you, you distracted me. I was trying to alert you about the crates, you overrated fan serve. Oh, wait, stop that. If you're going to piss off the fans, do it properly. <coughs> Oliver is a weak character, is badly written, series full of mediocre at best. Edward is over. Alright, alright, I get it. Just shut up. You've got some nerve dumping them crates onto the line. I didn't dump them. Oh, look, it's Bertie. He can help defend me. Oh, my goodness. What's happened here? Hey, Bertie, did I dump those crates onto the line? I don't know. Did you? No, I didn't. Look, Bertie, you know me. I'd never cause an accident. What about that incident at Ellsbridge a couple of weeks ago? Yeah, all right. But apart from that Tidmouth, the coal implant, that bomb on Kildane, okay, okay. Maybe I did do a few bad things, but I definitely did not cause this. And who did? There was a lorry. Very rude fella. Bumped into me and dumped those crates onto the line. Oh my. Well, did you get his license plate? I can't remember on the top of my head, but I think it was. What's going on here? Oh my, that's an accident if I haven't seen one. Good work, Smeg. Sabotage will make the other railways look bad. Shh. It wasn't Smeg that caused his accident. It was a lorry. In fact, I believe you remembered their license plate, Smeg. Oh, um. 
Lori. Yeah, off the court. <laughs> oh, I knew it. There was no Lori. You weren't there when Lori showed up. You literally appeared a moment after the Lori left. A yeah, likely story. Mm, I think you're fibbing. Fibbing? Yeah. I mean, you don't actually have any proof of Lori being here. No, I think this Lori you're talking about isn't real. Of course he's real. Smeg, with all due respect, he has a point. You can't really prove that there was a Lori. Yeah, um, but it wasn't me for crying out loud. Hey, now everybody calm down. Arguing isn't going to achieve anything. Oh, shut up, Mr. Freela Rhodes. Oh, it's you. Hello, Bulgy. Hello, Doc. Long time no see. You two friends? Yeah, not exactly friends. We've met before. Well, let's just say that. Right. So, Laurie. There is no Laurie. <laughs> there. That's the Laurie who's the one that bumped into me and dumped those crates. Just what have you got to say for yourself? Yeah, so what? I dumped some crates. What are you going to do about it? Well, the authorities for size. So it was you that did this? I must say, good work, fellow anti-rail revolutionary. Bulgy. Oh, I mean, how dare you cause this accident and pin the blame on Smeg? Now kindly wait here until we get the authorities and we'll have no more problems. Alright then, let me think. Never! Air! Oh no, he's getting away, and he's driving on the wrong side of the road. Quick, after him. Uh, um, okay. Stop! No! Shut off! Oh, okay. Smeggy, you want to see things tell him to stop and make him stop? Oh, well, it was worth a shot. Can't catch me, oh wait, fuck! Aha! We have you cornered. Come on, just give up. Running away from your problems isn't going to change anything. <laughs> Bertie, wait there. I'll come back. Lovely weather we're having. Get out of the way! Huh? Oh, uh, help! Rob, listen here, you. No, 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 wait. I'm sorry. I'll do whatever you want. Just don't push me off. You promise you will not run off if I save you? Whatever you want. Just hurry. Right, so... Ugh, you bastard. Oh my, that wasn't meant to happen. Is he alright? Oh no, probably. Bulgy, I should have known it was you. Uh oh, but sir, you, you don't understand. Oh, I think I do. I've had enough of your lies and your anti-railway nonsense. I've heard there are some hens that need a new home. N now, now listen. What for? This arsehole here was the one that moved the crates onto the line. Hmm. Laurie One, you have caused confusion and delay. I was told you wouldn't be trouble anymore when you came back to this island. But not only have you caused an accident, but you also got others into trouble. Yes, sir. So sorry, sir. I can't punish you for your actions, but I'm afraid I'll let the lorry company know what you did. Yes, sir. Sure. 
My, what an eventful day that was. Well, it's a world with now. Oi, Smag, I'm sorry I blamed you for causing that accident earlier. No, 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 it's just... But still, I don't really trust you or Bulgy either. <laughs> now, if you excuse me, I'm a little late. Good boy. Goodbye, you little bunny of prick. Wait a minute, something is off. What? While the lorry didn't move those crates onto the line, as you said, Smeg, but didn't you say that the lorry was originally carrying the crates? Yeah, actually, the crates were there on the road for the lorry arrived. And that raises the question, who was the one that dropped the crates onto the road? Hey, did anyone see some crates? I was almost sure no, I accidentally dropped them here. You did what? Oh yeah, the cables between the crates down weren't done properly. Hey, why are you free staring at me like that? Hey, Smeg. Yeah, what was it? You didn't actually go to the shops. Fuck!